And in another major decision, a California abortion law has been struck down. It required pro-life pregnancy centers to also advertise where women could go to get abortions. We have team coverage of both these decisions, starting with Kyle Harvey with a look at the impact of the change to California's abortion law. Kyle? Well, Dave Rochelle, Aaron Rodgers, the director at the local pregnancy center, went to D.C. to rally with other pro-life advocates outside the court during the hearing. They prayed for this ruling and are thrilled with the decision. I think we all are kind of breathing a sigh of relief today. For years, Aaron Rodgers and her colleagues at the Bakersfield Pregnancy Center have been waiting, praying for today's decision that strikes down Assembly Bill 775. The state was forcing us to advertise information that we, as a faith-based organization, objected to. What was the objectionable message, I asked? Information as to where women could get a free or state-sponsored abortion um, and it, we had to list it in a certain size font. It had to have specific wording and uh, gave information like phone numbers and addresses. That state message would need to be in the lobby and on every advertisement pregnancy centers produced. The problem for Rogers and hundreds in her position is that the pregnancy center exists to provide women alternatives to abortion, something that runs counter to Rogers' Christian faith. Pregnancy center volunteers provide counseling, ultrasounds, parenting classes and baby supplies, things to make having a baby easier, and young women respond. The center told donors last year it saved 667 babies. You know, they changed their mind in their pregnancy outcomes, so they went from being abortion determined or abortion minded to choosing to parent. The Supreme Court ruled that the state's required abortion messages imperils freedom of thought and belief. Clarence Thomas writing it unduly burdens protected speech. But the decision was split on the Supreme Court and in Bakersfield. Jennifer Bloomquist is a co-founder of Pro-Choice Kern County. How and where to find an abortion is information that's vital for women who may be scared and vulnerable, she says. We elect our lawmakers to write legislation that's in the best interest of the greatest number of people. Education is in the great interest of a great number of people. For more on what the justices on each side of the issue had to say, you can visit our website, bakersfieldnow.com. Reporting live in studio, Kyle Harvey, Eyewitness News.